My name's Nicole Van Bruggen and I'm a professional clarinet player and I specialise in playing historical clarinets. I have lots of instruments, they date from the mid 17th century until the late 19th century. The instrument that you just heard me playing is called a basset clarinet and it's the instrument for which Mozart wrote his clarinet concerto and his clarinet quintet. Uh, the reason I'm making this video is to let you know that I'll be performing the Mozart Clarinet Quintet with my fabulous colleagues from the Australian Romantic and Classical Orchestra. The dates are the 16th to the 24th of September and we'll be playing in the Blue Mountains, in the City Recital Hall in Sydney, in Melbourne Recital Centre and in the gorgeous Adelaide Hills. So I hope if you live close by you might be able to join us for one of those concerts. The basset clarinet uh, is a very peculiar instrument. There are only two pieces of music written for the instrument, that is the concerto and the quintet by Mozart. The reason for this is that the instrument was actually lost uh, during Mozart's time, and so he never wrote for it anymore, and it was the only one of its kind, uh, so there was never any more music composed for this particular instrument. The reason it's called a basset clarinet is because of these four keys on the back of the instrument. Normally when we play the clarinet, we don't do anything with our right thumb. The instrument rests, uh, we usually have a thumb rest here, and the instrument rests on the thumb. But for the basset clarinet, we can operate these four keys on the back of the instrument, and they allow us to play four extra notes. I'll just demonstrate the sound of those notes for you. A normal clarinet goes down to a written E, but we have uh, three, uh, four extra ones. So these are the four extra notes that we have on this instrument. There's also a very odd looking section at the front here. Uh, the reason for this mostly is for resonance uh, and also to allow a hole big enough for the sound to come out. Uh, Mozart used the four basset notes uh, quite a lot in his quintet and in his concerto. So uh, what's interesting to know as, a, as an audience of today is that when you hear the Mozart clarinet concerto or quintet being played on a modern, on a normal modern clarinet, uh, you're usually hearing an arrangement uh, of the piece because the instrument doesn't have those four low notes and so the music has been adapted to fit onto a clarinet. Uh, and the charm of playing those two works on an actual basset clarinet is we can play the notes that Mozart originally intended us to perform. Uh, and for me, the uh, even more important bonus is to play it on a replica of the exact instrument which Mozart had in mind when he was composing the works. So with these instruments, it's made of a much softer wood and we have a smaller mouthpiece and a hand wound reed and there are many, many differences with a modern clarinet. Um, all of these differences lead to us being able to make uh, a lot more colours in the sound and have a lot more flexibility and, um, and to create more character in the music and make it a little bit more like conversation. So that's, uh, that's the aim of, of, of our performance style. Uh, it's a style that I've been specialising in for uh, almost 25 years now. I moved to Holland um, uh, many years ago and stayed there for 17 years um, specialising in period instrument performance and what we now call HIP, which stands for Historically Informed Performance. So this means that we don't only play on instruments from the period, such as these ones, but we also play in a different style. We have a different way of articulating, a different way of phrasing, um, and it's a different approach to the music altogether. So uh, if you're close by in Sydney or Melbourne, Blue Mountains or the Adelaide Hills, I hope you can join us. Uh, I look forward to seeing you at the concert and if you have any more questions feel free to send me a message or uh, come and see me after the concert and I'll talk to you for hours about my basset clarinet. Thanks.